welcome to another video. Um, we're trying a new app because I'm having problems with my old phone and I can't get the same app on this phone <clears throat> today. Um, she's still got chicken pox, but um, she's mostly crusted over, so tomorrow she'll be back to normal. Today we have followed on our Wales theme by looking at castles because Wales is famous for lots of castles. So what I've done is, is that was all set up. All my videos are on my other phone and I can't get them across at the moment. Um, I made her a makeshift castle out of a cereal box and a couple of other boxes and then I put down green grass with the um, green pashmina and then the green scarf with the flowers on. It was meant to be a flower bed and she has been playing with her blocks and her fairy and um, her hey doggy toys and stuff. She's been playing with them in there. What she was just doing, she's just moved. Eeyore is by our back door. She has just been cuddling Eeyore, telling him, don't worry, it's just rain, telling me that Eeyore won't cheer up. It is raining more. I am going to have to get my washing in. So, um, if I can get my other videos across, I shall put them straight on here after this one. Otherwise, we're going to have to make a new video for you guys. You show me them? How well have our peas done? Good. We haven't grown enough to, like, pick a load and put in a dinner or anything like that. Because they keep... They're ready at different times. So today there's, like, one ready. Yesterday there were two ready. And if we had six buckets of peas well, is that a bug on one though bab check it yeah is that a bug or is that pick, just a pick it off it's not pick it off well i think it was just a bit of black bab always check before you put them in your mouth though um so we're looking forward to when our blueberries start to turn we're looking forward to when our strawberries start to turn we're already eating our spinach Every now and then, Rosie likes to help us out with the mint plant. I occasionally have a mint cup of tea. I might even repot it so that it can grow bigger because it's limited in that little pot. Mummy? Isn't it? Oh, there we go. Can we see if I can find you another one? Yeah. This is what happens as soon as they're ripe. She eats the one and then there's not enough to put in the dinner, but she's eating fresh. Organic veg. So what's, what's Wales famous for, Babs? Castles. So Mummy has literally, out of all the spare boxes we have today, just made Rosie a... And I realised I put that turret on the wrong way around. A castle. So she's got her... Don't Rosie can find her princesses. No, my figure. It'd be better if we painted it. My actual figures. Yeah, you could put your people in there. My actual figures. Or you could put Dougie in there. No. My Dougie and the squirrels in there. But I have a book, I have an Esbon book upstairs with lots of lift the flaps in to read about castles and stuff. Do we have to do spooky monsters for her? I don't know where the rest of the castle's gone, Nor boss. Nori's gonna go. So Rosie's gonna have some fun playing with this. It's literally just. I don't like how much. Because we order our stuff online, we can't, we can't control how much plastic comes. Um, if you want to play inside it, Bab, you turn it round and the back's open on two of them, okay? I cut the backs out on two of them. Oh, Mum. Can I help? Can you help? Turn it around. You can play inside the castle. Um, um, it means that we can't pick like fruit and veg that doesn't have the plastic wrap around it. They, they give us stuff that's in plastic bags and stuff. We're working on how we can shop and still afford our shop. Um, Daddy, trying to reduce our plastic Daddy, waste. Especially with Ripple down the road. Um, but it does mean for crafts we have plenty of cardboard and, st and bits and bobs like that. So, yeah, we're going to play with our castle for a little bit. Tomorrow we're going to read about castles a bit more. We read about dragons today with Room on the Broom. And we're also chatted about who would live in a castle. We will. Who would live in a castle? I think there's someone in this little pink box who might live in a castle. Do you reckon she'd live in the castle? Who's in there? <laughs> Who's in there? Oh. Oh, I thought it was a princess, but it's a fairy. She might live in the castle gardens. You could set that up as the castle garden, couldn't you? What? Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to 
go and find my green pashmina. I am going to lie it on the floor so it's grass. We're going to put her castle on it and then we're going to set up a castle garden. Let me see if she can find something small and blue for a river. And it's going to be a bit kind of Montessori inspired. Play today. I'll show you when we've got it all together. So we have the green, green grass at the back of the castle. We have our flowers in the castle where the fairy's going to live. The fairy's over there somewhere. And then we have our big pond. So you don't need to go out and buy a load of stuff. And if you can crochet, you can make most of this. Um, but this is just, this is a pashmina, a green pashmina I have. This is a beautiful scarf. I ever got it in the charity shop or I got given it. I never wear it. I just keep it exactly for this. It's really pretty. I just don't know how you tie them around your head and I'm not one for wearing them in the springtime. And then this is a, a shawl. This is a shawl. hanky. This is just a blue hanky that's going to be our lake and our pond. So the fairy can live and work there. I didn't realise this little set that my my student one of my students brought for Rosie in. She handed it down to her. I didn't realise it had rabbits in it. So we're going to have fun playing with some castle stuff. We might make it some castle facts. Um, and when she's better, obviously, because we have a lot on in the week. Our trip this week is going to be coming up. Uh, we're going to be going to St Fagans to learn about the history of Wales and the houses through the ages and everything, because we missed it last week because of the chicken pox. And then if Rosie doesn't mind going twice, because she insists that we've got to wait for Nanny. No, Rosie doesn't mind going twice. Next Friday, once I get back from work, Rosie will be going to Cardiff Castle. With you. Mm -hmm. To see one of the castles. And then hopefully the following week, I think my mum's back from holiday, and I think we're going to Caerphilly Castle. So we're going to go visit a couple of castles in the next couple of weeks so that Rosie can see them. Hopefully we'll have some fun there. So, we've played with our castle. We've talked about kings and queens who might live in castles. We're going to see if we can find a documentary when we get back from the shop in a minute. Rosie's just finishing her lunch, which she shared. Well, a card from Tesco's. I don't know if I want to walk all the way down to Tesco's, Babs. That's even further. Oh, we have the car there. So we might build some more castles out of our blocks. I don't know how long the cardboard castle I made her will last. She's made a right mess of this room today. You've been having fun, haven't you? Mm -hmm. Lots of imaginative play. <clears throat> Lots of free imaginative play as well while I'm trying to work out how this new app goes together. Hopefully this video won't be a complete disaster. So for today, for now, we shall say to Tar from me and to Tar from... The Rosie Bear. Was the 